You know? Is there a reason why you're a fan of like people like Asmin Gold or Doc? If I met Doctor Disrespect or Asmin Gold, I would be like, Yo, I fucking love you guys. Like Asmin Gold, I just like that he doesn't take shit and he's a good entertainer. Doctor Disrespect, he like doesn't take shit and he's just such a good entertainer. Like I love the way he claps back at people because I do the same thing. So I think it's just like fucking awesome. Yeah, I want him to like stuff of mine. I get on his like know. chat and I chat in there and he just never sees it. I've donated like twenty five hundred dollars. Wow. Wait, Wait, Whoa. Wait, It'll be like 500, 500, 500. Wait, 500 dollars? Yeah. And he's like 500 bucks at a time? And he never pays attention to me. That's because the two time ain't no simp. If you don't know who Dr. Disrespect is, he's a famous streamer, arguably could be one of the biggest streamers in the world. And the woman, she's a famous corn star. A lot of guys simp over this chick, but not the doc. He ain't trying to eat leftover food off the floor. He ain't into loose puss. He took that 2500 and just blanked her. He ain't no simp. The guy's a 10, but he has an android. What is he now? <laughs> He's like a two. <laughs> I'm sorry, what? What about that makes him all the way like to a two? I, I just can't. You just don't like that green when you're texting? Yes, the green bubbles just, it's an ink for me. <laughs> they're, they're cooked, guys. I'm sorry, man. His wife is currently being canceled because she created a PS5 time schedule for her husband where he has to do various different things just so he could play his PS5. I just want to say really quick, the wife is not the girl in the video in the beginning. I just feel like that is how she would act. So this is the time schedule right here. So for 30 minutes to play on his PS5, he has to give his wife a foot rub. For 40 minutes, he has to give his wife a back rub. For an hour without playing online so he can't play with his friends, he has to cook dinner for an hour to play on his PS5. No, 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 no. No, 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 yeah. no. Hell no, hell no. He's in a controlling relationship and he's got to use a controller to play the game. Kind of ironic. If he's doing all that, what the hell is she doing? These are the same girls that say you don't spend time with me, but they want you to sit and watch their bullshit on Netflix for hours on end. Listen, just do what I did. Just get yourself a gamer girl. Me and my wife play video games together. Simple fix, boys. When he takes a nap, it irrationally annoys me. <clears throat> oh, excuse me. Where did, where did you get that? Oh, excuse me. I didn't mean to disturb you, but I really thought that you were extremely beautiful. Because when I was walking. Oh. Damn. So freaking nice. Oh, excuse me. Sorry, Bali. I know it's gonna be really random, but I really thought you was cute. Oh, okay. Are you single by any chance? Oh, you're married. Ouch. Sorry about that. I just wanted to see you look very beautiful. Thank you. Not just so you have a best year this year. All right, take it easy. All right. <clears throat> Mission failed. We'll get him next time. Well, you can't knock him for this. He's doing exactly what they want. They say they want guys to approach him. He's doing that. This guy's doing what a lot of guys don't want to do. A lot of guys are too scared to approach women these days. Rightfully so. But we don't know what this guy looks like. We don't know what he's wearing. You know, we're only going by what they see. Do y'all trust each other 100%? Yes. Yeah. Maybe we test that theory. By doing what? Swapping phones. Okay. Yeah. Well, let's get it. Let's get it. Let's go through uh, Snapchat. Is that a phone shoot? Yeah. Alright. Go through her phone first. It's on this side. Corner. Why me first? I mean, because you're on my side. Just make it more nah, quicker. Alright, well, then we're going to get to her phone, I guess. Let's right. do the man first. Let's get it. All we're going right. to go Snapchat. Hey, you better not be deleting stuff. I'm going to peep it. Alright, you good on that. You got to take a call. Suspicious activity. Hey, man, this is a faithful guy right here. You know what I'm saying? So he passed. Hey, hey, what's the whispering? Uh, my mom called me. I can't. She can't do this right now. I, I like, actually, yeah. I, I can't go through your Snapchat. 
deciding to go. So that's a little suspicious activity. Yeah. What's your advice to to all the unhealthy relationships? Get her, bro. She leaving. Bro, why why she be, why she being like that, bro? Don't you find like that was low key weird though? Uh, not really. I, I I think it was something serious. Like, Damn, she gone. She, go. she belongs to the streets. She's high in time, bro. She's a runner. She's a runner. You just wait till she meets someone that does something better than you. She'll be out of there. Just like she was in this video. But she'll be off with another guy, man. Sadly, I don't think this guy got it. He's living in the dream world still. And there's plenty of guys out there just like him. Have you ever ghosted someone? Yes. Yeah. What? I ghosted someone three days ago. Wait, but I thought... Are you single? Um, no. I'm actually not single. So were you like ever talking to this person you guys? Oh, oh! Congratulations, you played yourself. So I just left the restaurant after waiting 30 minutes for a date to show up. And apparently I got stood up. I don't know what to say. Like I'm trying to do everything right to be a gentleman. I brought flowers. I've been consistent talking with this girl for two weeks. Trying to get to know what she likes, what she doesn't like. I made plans. I picked the restaurant, the day and the time. You know, I've done everything to be... Just the kind of guy that would value somebody's time. Like, I just, I'm just looking for my person. I'm just looking for the one that, I guess, is out there for me. I mean, I want to be somebody's husband someday, father. I'm trying to do everything that's right. I just get stood up. Like, my feelings don't even matter. Sitting there eating a meal by myself. And realizing that nobody even cares. It's an evil world we live in. Do you know what? My heart goes out to this guy. He seems like a nice, genuine fella. But don't worry, bro. It's happened to all of us. It's happened to all of us. Girls will say guys are cold hearted, but girls can be on a whole nother level. You know, this girl didn't even text him. Just the courtesy of saying, look, I can't make it. She really just chilling at home, probably laughing about it. Keep doing your thing, man. You're doing the right thing. There are good women out there who will appreciate you being a gentleman. You did everything right. You didn't do nothing wrong. You dodged a bullet, my friend. Look at that. Uh, excuse me. What do you do for a living? <laughs> Why do you care? This is our car. Oh, this is your car? Yes. Wow. It looks very amazing. Can you start the engine? I want to, li to listen to the sound. The, the engine is very, very loud here, yeah? No. Don't touch my car, please. <laughs> Don't touch my car, honey. This is not your car. <laughs> if women are drafted to the military, I am most excited to see the confrontation between commanding officers and the girls. You between commanding officers and the girls? Oh dear. Think we're gonna let you yell at us? You think we're gonna do something without a please and thank you? Please allow me to introduce a little reality into this situation because personnel in the military are under legal obligation to follow all lawful orders that they are given. And a please and a thank you are not required. We've all had controlling ex-boyfriends. We know not to put up with that bullshit. It's almost as if they're not understanding that it's not just men that are in positions of authority in the military. Like, let's sit down and have a conversation about what you want and what I want, and we'll reach a happy medium. <laughs> because there's no way I'm doing what you want when you use that tone with me. You think you can push us around like you do with these men? Think again, baby. You're going to learn some manners. And I think one would learn very quickly that having a bad attitude and obvious problems with people in positions of authority wouldn't get one very far. But most importantly, the Uniform Code of Military Justice doesn't play. He actually went out and decided to make that video, you know, and not think, do you know what? I could look like a dumbass, but who cares? Do you know what? We need to get this girl drafted, get her in the military, make it a Netflix show, because that would be hilarious. And I can really see what sort of girl this is in a relationship, you know, not respecting the man. She wants a man who provides for her, protects her. But how can you do that with no position of authority? and responsibility doesn't make sense good luck to this girl man she has a lot to learn what a donut i don't know why he's using a real golf ball and claiming it's not hitting the wall it's not hitting the wall but it is hitting the wall that's no, fine it's hitting the net <laughs> 
Ready? Check the swing, check the swing. The only conclusive thought I have from this video, you're in the doghouse, man. 100%.